and welcome. Today we are taking a full look at the Adventure Force Desperado, which is actually a dart zone blaster and is double action. We do not get very many double action blasters, so it's always exciting to have a new one coming out. The Desperado is claiming 60 feet, which is pretty impressive for a double action blaster. Let's jump right in. Included in the box, of course, we have the Desperado itself and we get 12 waffle darts. Now let's go over the Desperado. Starting out, we do not have any sling mounts or rails on the blaster, but we do have a pair of iron sights, which look totally fine, but keep in mind, it is harder to aim a double action blaster. Right up front, we do have the cylinder. It rotates very easily and holds six darts. A six round capacity seems really great for the size of this blaster. It is very, very compact. And this blaster retails for under $9, which is just really impressive. Ergonomically, I'm not really sure how I feel about the blaster. Like the nail biter, this double action blaster has a huge trigger. With that considered, it is pretty comfortable. For me, the handle could be a little bit bigger, but it's definitely not something that'll get in the way of enjoying this blaster. And like I said, the Desperado is double action. If you don't know what that means, it means that instead of having some kind of priming handle, the blaster actually fires and primes through just the trigger. And of course, this is a Springer. It does not require batteries. Right out of the box, assuming you have darts loaded, to fire the blaster, simply squeeze the trigger. That is a very smooth action and the Desperado is super fun to fire. But like with any double action blaster, the Desperado is a little bit more challenging to actually aim. Let's fire this thing again. So far this thing is just incredible, but let's take the Desperado outside and put it over the chronograph. All right, we will be using the included waffle head darts. 73, 70, 71, 72, 68, and 74. So the Desperado, while being a double action blaster, actually hits like a standard primary class elite blaster. That's actually pretty impressive because the double action nerf brand blasters like the Nail Biter, the Voidcaster, and the Snapfire 8 have all hit under 60 feet per second. So as a double action blaster, the Desperado being able to hit 70 feet per second easily is really incredible. I am very satisfied with that performance. Now let's fire some shots downrange. The Desperado does not have air restrictors, so it sounds a little bit nasty when you dry fire. But interestingly, if I just rotate it here, stick my finger in the barrel, it has an incredible seal, which I was not expecting. So what are my final thoughts on the Dart Zone Desperado? The Desperado is just a really great double action blaster. Of course, it's not a game changing powerhouse, but the Desperado is a new, incredibly reliable and affordable double action pistol. It's super compact for having a six dart cylinder and the double action works really smoothly. This blaster is a breeze to fire. If you're looking for this kind of blaster, I can definitely recommend the Desperado, especially at the price. This this thing is a really solid offering from Dart Zone, and if you are interested, I will have the link in my description. Thank you very much for watching. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this blaster, especially if you do have one. Subscribe for more, have a good one, and happy blasting.